हेलो स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास नाइन माय सेल्फ सुभाष मिश्रा स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू कंडक्ट वन ऑफ योर प्रैक्टिकल रिलेटेड विद बायो दैट इज सेल इफ यू डिफाइन द सेल सेल इज द बेसिक यूनिट ऑफ लाइफ स्ट्रक्चरली एंड फंक्शनली स्टूडेंट्स why do we call it as structural unit of life and why do we call it as functional unit of life you know very well all living beings they are made up of cells these cells are the building blocks as your house it is made up of very small unit that is bricks since cells they used to make the whole body of the living beings that is why we call it as structural unit of life and since cells perform all the functions of the body that is why it is functional unit of life now robert hook has first observed the cell after that as time passes we have explored we have uh, 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 discovered different different parts of the cells nowadays we know lot of cell organelles as you know in cell you can, you get nucleus cytoplasm vacuoles mitochondria uh, lysosomes and rest of the cell organelles okay in plants and animals cells are differ as you know in plants larger vacuoles are found animals they have smaller vacuoles or it may be absent plastids are present in only plant cell not in animal cells okay. cell wall it is only present in plants not in animals likewise different uh, more differences are there i am not going detail of it because my topic is to uh, show you how you are going to prepare the slide right so now we will come to our topic that how we are going to prepare its slides students you must know how you have to write the experiment in your practical record so there are certain steps which you have to follow first of all you have to you have to write the aim of the experiment that is today the experiment which we uh, are going to conduct that is to prepare temporary amount of onion peel and to observe and find out the observation so this was the first step. this is the first step the second step is material required as in this experiments the material which is required is onion watch glass onion you can see this is the onion now watch glass watch glass is like this you can see it is a uh, uh, it is made up of glass the second next thing is that is cover slip cover slip you can see this is the cover slip it is very thin piece of glass now the next thing which needed that is forceps we need a sharp blade 
after the we need water in the lab we used to take the water in beaker then we need a coloring pigment that is sulfuronine we need glycerin to keep our section wet we need filter paper or blotting paper so these are the things which we need this is the material these are the materials which are required for this experiment so you have written aim the material required after that comes procedure so for this experiment now i am going to give you the detail of procedure 